Thank you, thank you, thank you, Lord. Today is Lord's day, every day Lord's day. Yeah. I wanna tell you the revelation that I have received from the God. Spirit touch me, Holy Spirit touch me. Revelation, prophetic message you will receive it with your face right now, right now, receive. Prophetic message I'm going to deliver to you. Hallelujah. Pray the Lord. Amen. Oh, thank you, Lord. You got the victory. Yes, Lord. Victory. Because Jesus said, I overcome this world. The Holy Spirit is in you that you got the victory. As Jesus Christ said, in this world. Hallelujah. Your Heavenly Father knows that. You need, listen, a breakthrough. Oh, I like it. I love this. I love this word. Breakthrough. Breakthrough concerning specific and extremely important issue you are facing now. I'm going to deliver to you. Prophetic message God gave to me. Hallelujah. Pray the Lord. Amen. Give the glory. Hallelujah. Give the glory name of God. Hallelujah. Pray the Lord. The word of the Holy Spirit concerns your needed breakthrough. I'm telling you, it may not seem like anything it happened right now. Hmm? But get ready. You need to get ready. Be prepared your mind to receive this word I'm going to tell you right now. Hallelujah. Because no matter how much you're not that, yeah, yeah. opposition, I don't know what blockage is. Blocked your way, oh, and the devil's skin going to hurt you. I don't know, but I, I do know. You break through, which I'm going to tell you this message, prophetic message. You have received in your face. It's going to break all your block and opposition that comes from every way. You will be breakthrough and get the victory. Glory to the God finally. Hmm? I see in the spirit that your prospects are actually shaping wonderfully, miraculously, you never expect people. I see, I see the Holy Spirit. I see, I believe Holy Spirit touch me, that I'm going to Preach this message for you, just for you who listen and receive in your face this prophetic message. You're going to enjoy your obedience to God. I believe it because you're going to listen. My message right now, it's not coincidence, it's not accidents. This is the will of God, I believe that. You are listening to this message, yeah? yeah? God can open the door and unlock your miracle blessing when nothing else is to will. 
God going to open the door. Your blessing be oh, into your mind. Holy Spirit definitely urging you, I believe, to extend your reach to the Lord. Yeah, that's why my joy is overflow when I preach this message. Because you are listening. Hallelujah. Oh, thank you. Pray the give glory. My God is good. Hallelujah. Lord, help me. Oh, Holy Spirit, help me. Thank you, Lord. Oh, thank you. Salabati, Kirabati. Pray the Lord. Amen. Do you know? Do not limit in your mind God's power. Do not put the the limit when you know that your face God make it possible to do all things you want to do. Hmm? God Bible says uh, uh, I remember Mark 9 chapter 23. Yeah. If you can, I can. You can in Jesus Christ. All things are possible. <laughs> Hallelujah. If you can, if you can, Jesus said, if you can, I can. Say again, follow me. I can do. I can do all things. I can do all things in Jesus Christ who strengthens me. Philippians 4 13. Mark 9 23. If you can, all things are possible those who believe. My, my, the, 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 the 1926, with the man all things are possible, with God, uh, sorry, with man all things are not possible, with God all things are possible. Hmm? Jesus said to rich man, no, you know that. Oh, my hallelujah, pray the Lord. This is bureaucracy break, no, no, break through, I, I forgot. Bureaucracy blessing break through covenant, that's so good. <laughs> bureaucracy blessing break through covenant, you got that from God. Don't forget. I say again, bureaucracy blessing. Blessing. I'm especially uh, talking to financial blessing. Miracle blessing, covenant breakthrough. Direct, I believe, direct the relation to the Holy Spirit message I am preaching right now. That I am, am emphasizing over and over to receive this message, don't fail to receive in your mind, keep in your mind as your covenant God going to you. Hallelujah. Pray the Lord. Amen. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, liberation. Liberation. Will unfold through your face, I believe that. It's going to open. As long as you keep this face to the Lord, we receive this word, covenant breakthrough, blessing message that going to reach you, to bless you. All your area in this life, hallelujah, I believe. Huh? Your decision can invoke, invoke, plea to the Lord by prayer, invoke. Complete change your current issue you have right now. Huh? 
I, I'm going to give you this word, blessing, covenant message. You have to hold. I want you hold, keep in your mind this message I'm going to tell you right now. Deuteronomy 8, chapter 28. Remember, remember the Lord. For it, yeah, for it is the Lord who gives you the power to get the wealth. Remember the, your God, He is who gives you power to get the fortune you want to get. Bible did not say God gonna give you cash. He didn't say God gonna give you gold and silver. No. This, this, just this Bible says, I told you, God gonna give you the power to get the wealth, fortune you want to get. Think about that. Huh? All fortune does not come from luck. You may be expected any all things world city does not give to you money without religion huh? Washington DC does not give you your fortune no all things you want to get and you did all material did God pour out and give it to you. Pour out. Hallelujah. That is Bible said my God will supply all your need according to his richly in Glory of Jesus Christ. Philippians 4, chapter 9, today's text. Hmm? It comes from the God. Something exciting is ahead. Something tremendously and thrill thing you're going to feel, you're going to see by your eyes is spread in your eyes. My friend, believe what I'm saying. Through the God's message I'm preaching, preaching right now. Hmm? Oh, you're going to sit the driver's seat. You can handle the drive your car which God going to give you, I will call blessing car, fortune car. You going to drive, God want to drive, to put down in driver's seat, not passenger seat. But what this blessing is you can taste. No, let me tell you, even though Jesus was divine, he's God, he still had financial need in the flesh. Let me tell you, I want to tell you the Bible. He experienced a problem in personal relationship. Matthew 17, chapter 27. <clears throat> oh, hallelujah. You know, Jesus did with his disciples 
and paying taxes. Do you believe that? You can see the Bible. Jesus want to Peter go to the sea, get the fish and open the mouth of the fish. You can see the drachma and give it to the government. The your tax, my tax. <laughs> Jesus needs money. How much more we need money as long as you live in this world? Because we need, not ourselves, for the glory of God going and make provision for your need for this money. If you follow the God's guideline, God's instruction, and when you respond to, to the covenant of this guidance and instruction, God will give to you everything you need hallelujah my friend i see in the spirit i can see a change coming change coming that may bring diversity and cheer into your life. Oh, oh, thank you, Lord. My brother and sister, your Father in heaven is removing every cause every obstacle of your emotional load and resolving conflict for which you are burdened and you are struggling to get rid of those burdens you don't like. But God is going to take out this heavy burden. Matthew 11, 28. You can make this a reality. Ah, yeah, listen. My My friend, you can do, you can make a reality. I said reality. You can touch it, you can feel, you can smell, you can do. That is a reality. You can make this root in complying with his spiritual instruction and covenant. You are receiving this my message. Prophetic word given for your spiritual edification. It I believe this message going to build your spiritual power, spiritual muscle, you want to be. Oh, precious God, you friend. Oh, hallelujah. You are the royal. You are the children of God. You are the, his loyal priesthood. 
You are a special person. Please receive this message, this spiritual word. God is going to reveal to you through the, my mouth right now. Because time is very fast. Time is moving quickly like a flying bird. I have revealed to you that there is a great purpose in your life than you have yet discovered. I, com I have confidence what I say. I know what I am speaking to you because I am preaching God's revelation message. He, Holy Spirit touching me right now. It is my purpose. Not, not my. God's purpose toward you, through the, my mouth, mouth. Today, today is important, very, very important moment. Don't miss it. Don't miss it. I, I'm telling you. Catch this word in your face. Hallelujah. It is my purpose. I say again. Not my purpose, God's purpose. Yeah. That many mysteries, because this world is, is filled with mysteries. But you know, I know through the Bible. These mysteries can be opened to you. Because you have a spiritual eyes to see what's going on. This world, unbeliever doesn't know because they are afraid. Finally, they go to hell. You, me, we go to a heaven, heavenly country. Nothing afraid. No, no afraid. Fear not. Fear not. Do not be afraid. We are Happy. Happy is a blessing. Hebrew word. No mysteries can be withheld from the, my mind right now. I'm telling you that is open to my spirit. I'm telling you. I'm serious. It is time. I, I, I'm going to make a conclusion, but I don't have much time. It's time for you to set the due course in your life. Due course, I know. I believe you have already due course that you may not satisfy, but this time change your course. If you think you're going the long way, after hear the, this message, you may change. That's what I'm telling you. You cannot be happy with life unchanged, I believe. The new goals you want to make, I'm going to help you. That's what I'm preaching. Establish, can remove Apathy, apathy, that is very bad. Apathy. Focus on Jesus Christ. Focus on the, to the right thing. Focus on everything that God wants to you. You are being set free from the feeling of inadequacy and due, I believe, enthusiasm, due enthusiasm is being created because you are going to change your goal in your mind. 
receiving this message, I hope if you think the call you had made already, this may in turn this time release, regenerate, oh that's so good, regenerate the power, power into your spirit. Oh, this message is going to give to you, I say again, regenerate the power and release setting your mind that you've been long way, gonna change the power to speak, blessing into your own life is in you and mind. You must discover the ways. I hope so. You must find the way you have to go right now. God is going to show you. Use this power and his wisdom in your mind and your spirit. Thank you, Lord. He will, no, yeah, his will can enter your future. Jesus promised that he would never leave you, never forsake you. Hebrews 13, chapter 5. Holy Spirit remained you. Holy Spirit is in lead you, guide you until you go to heaven. Because you are new creature, you are the new person in Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. And also you have good goal. You have changed. Because I believe you have received this prophetic message I have told you. Holy Spirit, touch me. You accept this message. You, I want to change your goal, your life that you've been doing the wrong way. Right now, change that today's message. I will tell you, this is God wants to me, it is my mission to preach to you. God will, I'm going to deliver to you, to help you. And He can enter your mind by the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit has it, dwells in you and lives in you. And another counsel to teach you. Jesus is making intercession for you in heaven. He is going to, yeah, he's going to help you intercess God's work for you and listen God wants your prayer to listen every time, all the time. Seven day, 24 hours, seven day, all the time. Hallelujah, pray that. Nothing, nothing worry about. God is going to give it to you. Blessing. Financial blessing, hallelujah. Pray that you need to get this material. God wants you to know, Heavenly Father wants you to know, you need this material because you are going to follow the God's instruction, God's guidance this time. Because 
you change it, your way. So you make the mind to live the God's will, God's glory. God will be pleased. So God is going to open the door, unlock every way you can see. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Keep your mind. Pray the Lord. Oh, thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Pray the Lord. This is so good. I'm going to, Holy Spirit, touch me right now. I'm going to pray for the, those who seek and illness. Uh, pray to the, I see the Holy Spirit. Thank you, Lord. Right now, the, my spirit is praying to the Lord. Holy Spirit, touch and send the word of the, those who the cancer would be long time. She, she is a shield right now. God told me she is a shield from the breast cancer. Hallelujah. By the power of God, divine power of God. Thank you, the glory to the Lord. Oh, pray the Lord. Thank you, Lord. The spiritual problem in the, the guy in addict, the alcohol, the tobacco, and opido. He is free. He is only 30 age. He is free right now. I'm, I, I believe he is free. Yes, he is, he is free that from the addiction of the, the alcohol, the tobacco, or pill. He is free. He is spiritual. Pleasure he going to enjoy right now. Thank you, Lord. Pray the Lord. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Pray the Lord. Oh, I'm just so, so glad about that. It, it hurt in the back. It, it uh, healed right now by the power of God. I pray to the Lord. Thank you, Lord. And, and the diabetes patient is healed right now. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Pray the Lord. Amen. Thank you. Oh, my next time I see you again. See, I hope, I really hope next time, see the, my message, you will be blessed. Thank you. Bye bye, my brethren. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord.